it says, follow me, and it says, the things I've done you can do. And furthermore, it says, I'll help you do it. Ask me into your life, and I'm there, and I'm God, and I don't lie, just accept it. And if you're hungry, come on, I'm going to serve you some steak, because I'm in you. And I'm hungry to have you grow, and furthermore, I'm hungry to be in you, so people can see the truth of me that did exist, that hasn't died, and still exists. He was an example of what people could do if they hunger. First love, then hunger. And hunger so much you seek, knock, find. And then these miracles, they're not miracles. It's just truth. He said, I am the light. That means look at me in your darkness. Do you see me the light? Aren't you drawn to the light? Aren't I an example of beauty beyond darkness? I am the way. Now what does he mean like that? Isn't Muhammad the way? Isn't Buddha the way? Actually, yes. Right. But the way of following to become in unity with the Creator, the Great Dreamer. I am the way. And it's done through love, seek, knock, find, and hunger so great, you know, love, hunger, hunger so great that you keep pounding on that door, pounding on that door, trying to prove if it's true or false, until dang that door either doesn't open or fall down in front of you and you walk in. And you learn that part was true. And if that door went down or opened in front of you, what about the rest? Well, let's go on and see there. Check, 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 check. Not only everything, but check it until you know it's true. No. Christ was God on earth, in a human form, acting totally as a human. And he checked, 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 and the door finally opened or fell down in front of him. He was an example for us to follow. And he said, follow me. That does not mean all right, ask me into your life and, and, and tra-la-la. It means ask me in your life and follow me. Go back to where I started from and follow. So the secret is, if I'm getting this, is follow me, meaning don't worship me, but be like me. Be like me. I'm your it example. It is automatic but... to be like him, yeah. to, to, for you to be like him, right. for you himself you're in trouble <laughs> but for wanting to do good like healings and and without any thought of uh, recompense on your part mm -hmm. just wanting to help your fellow man mm -hmm. then you're not in trouble mm -hmm. now jesus didn't go out there and put on a show and dance and got rich and sat in a mansion mm -hmm. he made through life quite nicely thank you follow him Follow him as an example, and follow his example. And so, yeah, it's it just, these Christians, they got it so wrong, they got just a little bit of right, but they haven't seen the whole overall picture. And guess what? The Muslims are the same way. They got a lot of love truth in their book, but they haven't seen the whole overall picture. If you want to be honest with you, you take all of what's out there, you study it, and you see what is good of whatever you're studying, what is of love and helps. Keep that. Anything that is of self or not of help, that is Lucifer's realm. Reject that and take the good. Take the good out of the Christian book. Take the good out of the Koran. The good out of the Buddhist. The good out of the Buddhist. You know, on and on and on. Take the good and get rid of the bad. Test it all. 
and you'll end up with one big handful of one thing, love. And love is, is uh, there, um, I want to say caressing, but that's not for what I'm looking for, uh, uh, compassion. When you start having compassion for people, that drunk on the street that's vomiting right in front of you, and you have compassion, instead of, ugh, pretty drunk, you know, you have compassion for that person that has just treated you like filth and dirt, and maybe robbed you or embezzled you, that person is living in self, that person doesn't know love, and you do, and you have compassion, you know, forgive them. Now there's Jesus on the cross, forgive them, all of us, Father, for they know not what they do. They are unaware that love rules over self. And he meant it. That was pure compassion when he said it. Total love, totally forgiving everybody that nailed him on the cross, brought him to the cross, and the world at large that is doing things that would cause that kind of mind structure throughout all humanity upon the earth. He really, he wanted Dad to forget everybody. God, I love them. I know that they are your children, my brother, my sister, and despite all the horrors that they are doing to me, and have done to me, and do to each other. Oh, God, I love them. Forgive them, Father. Now, there's compassion. And that's the kind of compassion that you're looking for. Now, you're asking about how do you identify some of these parts of the Bible that talk about these things? Well, I mean, I think what you're, I think what you're saying is not that there are not that there are tricks to reading between the lines of certain scriptures and well, you find, that you find tricks, a way to become they're... invisible and you read over here and you find the way to no, walk okay. on water. Not a trick, you, the yeah. very fact that it was right. done. You can read right. like, like Jesus said, I am. Right. Now the Christians make a big deal out of this. He is the I am. Mm -hmm. What is he saying? You are not. And yet you feel like you are something, so that makes you I am, and everybody else is not. He was telling the fact there's only one in that story, him. There's only one in that story, you. You are the I am. So you, 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 you in a sense, there's nothing at all between the lines there. It's just what did what is the opposite of I? You. What is the opposite of am? Am not. I am, you are not. You understand what I mean? And and so you you have to pick up. Look at we went through Genesis, that little first line. And it shows you how God created everything and continues doing it. No big boom unless there is a noise that he can understand in here. You know, it was a matter of thought, giving it consideration, and then giving audible sound to that consideration, vibration, and then considering, and all right, he gave it a, a, a thought, you know, it'd be nice to make the world a man, or something to play with out here, as badminton set, you know. And, and uh, it was just a nice idea, and he kind of liked the idea, so he went from that to, what would I do if I did do it? So he imagined, you know, in the, in the old breast on the back of the women versus in the front, you know. That's fun to dance with, but more fun to see coming. And uh, uh, he gave it all kinds of thought. And he, he liked what he was thinking and he gave him a tool to keep him mentally alert. I have a and question. Where does Richard's tree live? Where does Richard's... The tree that he made the other night? Where does it live? Where is that tree? He created, he made that tree. It's upstairs in his folder. Right, so, but isn't that another reality that he just... Well, certainly, he dreamed it into being. 
See, this is what I think he needs to hear and understand this. He was as God.